Governor Phil Scott cutting red tape on so-called FEMA trailers. He's temporarily suspending all state and local regulations that prohibit or delay emergency housing for Vermont flood victims. FEMA is still required to follow federal regulations, but this executive action removes the delay. 30 FEMA trailers are scheduled to be installed at the Old Country Club in Montpelier to house flood victims. Scott told us yesterday that getting the trailers approved has been a slow process. It's discouraging that it took so long, but uh, but I'm not surprised. Uh, these are, you know, big decisions to make. Uh, they had to find an area that was suitable to them. Uh, we're dealing with the federal government, and we're dealing with the local government, and we're dealing with the state at the same time. The FEMA trailers are currently staged along Interstate 91 in the Upper Valley. Scott says it won't be until the middle of the winter when the first FEMA trailers are installed in Montpelier when flood survivors can move.